Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Yeah, Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. And one of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. See some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor. You still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. <laughs> I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo now. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on. Hard to do that in a hmm. room. Not Talk much to, to see here. Named Antiquity Master 37. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Okay, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest 4 by 4 Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Just keep it slow, keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. Nowhere fast. We need traction here. Slip and slide in the rocks. <laughs> I got it. I got it. the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> I got mud in my mouth. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road, it might rain, might be muddy. But with Nate being so eager, he doubled the price. He would have doubled it anyway. How did we go through this whole goddamn... Oh, oh gee. shit!
Take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because... Why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. That mud's too slippery. Time to come up with a plan B here. Do it. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. Ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We clear the hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. <laughs> Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> oh, poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a form of squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, still taking a long time. Whoa! Now I'm definitely awake. Uh, 
Oh, would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Boys show their pretty faces. You all know what to do. We'll serve them right too. I'll bag them first. All right. Dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just waiting on approval from Nadine to blow it. Good. Place will... Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Sully, 
Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. So Rafe's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, if you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But, you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. So, how are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Hey, what do you make of the drawbridge, Nathan? A little out of place. But you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to protect something. Such as pirate treasure? <laughs> Maybe. <clears throat> Another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. And Bonnie. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Hey, be careful, kid.
Hey guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! That's your delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey kid, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. You two just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know. <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. that bridge down. Let's try that again. There we go. Right, one sec. I'll just wait with Sam. <clears throat> Ready? <laughs> Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Well, it was worth a try. 
try. Gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <laughs> right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. All set. Here we go. This one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Get off, kid. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <sighs> Can't get in that way. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Careful with that thing, kid. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. Heads up! Ah, Jesus! I said heads up! Hurry up, 
Fuck you too. And he's up. Man, wait up. Come on. Hey there, Victor, this way. He seems excited. Uh, he's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. Guys, <laughs> coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... That's, that's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <laughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery Sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here.
Jesus. Is that all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fuck. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? Confirming a suspicion. <laughs> They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Guess we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah.